All right, so um, this is our tutorial video, our little practice video. And this video is for two things. One, it's just for practice um, to run through our concert songs that it's coming up at the end of this month. Um, the other reason is to use this as a play along video for recording. So if you have not sent me a recording yet, then use this video to do so. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your phone and if you have an iPhone, you can use the voice memo app, which comes with every iPhone. It's like a stock um, app that every iPhone has. And all you do is go to this voice memo app and hit record. And you can set your phone just right in front of you like this on the desk or something like that. And what it does, it just records the audio. I don't need video. Um, if video is the only way that you can record your sound, then you can record a video and send me the video. And what I'll do is I'll take the audio off of that video because that's all I need to put together our, our um, concert songs. So video or audio recordings are fine. Email it to Mr. Brandon at bncinas at etmla.org. That's b e n c i n a s at etmla.org. I'm going to run very quickly through our concert songs. Um, so what that's going to look like is going to be the G major two octave scale, Twinkle of Stops, um, Alligator Snap Snap. Uh, let's see what else here. Uh, the Cuckoo Song, Plucking with Our Fingers, Carnival in Rio, Tango, Dancing in Avignon, and the Bow River Fiddling. So we're going to run through all of those really quickly. All right. So the other thing I need you to do is when you're doing your recording, make sure you have headphones on while you're listening to my video, because I do not want to hear the play along video in the recording. I want to hear you in the recording, not Mr. Brandon. <clears throat> so if you have to pause this video, go ahead and do so, and then go get those headphones, plug them in or connect them. All right. So we're going to start off with our G major two octave scale and here we go remember red red blue blue Double check that posture, double check those cookie jar hands. Here comes our twinkle with stops, the whole sandwich. Starting on that A string. And taka taka A string. Elbow to the E string. First finger E string. Zero fingers E string And one, two, three, bow Two fingers A string One finger A string Zero fingers A string Elbow to the E string One, two, three, bow Two fingers A string One finger A string to the E string. One, two, three, bow. Two fingers A string. One finger A string. Open A string. Elbow to the E string. First finger E string. Zero fingers A string. One, two, three, bow. 
fingers a string one finger a string zero fingers a string next is our alligator snap snap song so let's get ready for alligator snap snap here we go this is all on the e string e like elephant alligator snap snap alligator snap snap now get ready for the next one in the water ready here we go in the water Now think about hungry, alligators hungry, hungry, very slow bows, hungry. Very good. Our next one is our cuckoo song and we're going to take our bow, put them off to the side. We don't need them for this one. Take that thumb, turn it upside down, put it on the corner of the fingerboard. Our thumb is just going to be resting on the fingerboard, this black piece right here. We're not touching the violin. We're not touching the strings. It's just there to rest, okay? I'm going to close all of the rest of your fingers, pop out your pointer finger, and we're going to pull our string sideways. That's how we make a plucking sound. Here's a review. If you don't know your cuckoo song notes by heart already, you can just follow along by playing E, E. For those of you that have practiced your finger notes, here are your finger notes. E, A2, A3, a1 and then we just do it again e a2 a3 a1 again if that is something you haven't practiced yet you can just follow along like this you can follow us along with your e string okay all right here is our cuckoo song <laughs> E string first. E, A, two, three, one. E, A, two, three, one. And now we wait. E, A, two, three, one. Good. Next is our Carnival in Rio, and this is just a taka taka stop stop song on the E string, E like elephant. So here is our Carnival in Rio. Here we go. Taka taka stop stop. Taka taka stop stop. Taka taka stop stop. Next is going to be our tango. Remember, that's a popcorn and pizza and popcorn and pizza. All right, so here's popcorn and pizza on the E string for our tango. Ready? Here we go. Popcorn and pizza and popcorn and pizza. And we're going to do another popcorn pizza song on the E string, but this one's a little bit faster. And this one is called <clears throat> our 
Dancing in Avignon. Dancing in Avignon. Sounds like this. <laughs> Last but not least is our new rhythm called Run Pony, Run Pony. Let's do a practice one where we're just clapping with our hands first. Okay, this is called Run Pony, Run Pony. Sounds like this. Run Pony, Run Pony. 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 Keep clapping. Run pony, run pony. Good. So, just a quick little tutorial on our bowing here. We're just going to do that with a bow. Now I'm going to go from one color to the next for our runs. For our ponies, I'm going to stay right on the donut. Two little baby ones. Run pony, run pony, run pony, run pony. Okay, so that's the rhythm. All right, so here comes our um, our new song. Here we go, all on the E string. Run pony, run pony, run pony, run pony. Run pony, run pony, run pony, run pony. Run pony, run pony, run pony, run pony. You don't have to play that ending if you don't want to, but if you know it, you may. All right. Happy practicing.